Hey yo, this is your boy Mac 11. This one's for the road. I go by the name of Melody Napoleon, and uh, this is one for the road. Right, boy. This is Rince, and this is one for the road. Shout out to MC. Let's get it. Yo guys, it's Tim from Team C Media. We're checking in with a few of the greats from Melbourne City. We have the Oz vs. Vibes crew here, and we have Marvin and Russ who are gonna tee it off in June for the biggest event you guys are gonna see right here in Melbourne City. So I'm blessed for the guys to chill in the studio with me and kick it on One For The Road. Um, we'll start by just going around the room and everyone can introduce themselves and let, let the audience know, let Team C Media know what they're about, who they are, so take it off here, over here with Marvin, man. What's good, man? Yeah, what's up, bro? Um, <laughs> good, man. We're cool. We're cooling. Yes. We're literally cooling here in Melbourne City. That's the way, yeah. So I'm Marvin Priest, um, originally from London, uh, Jamaican background. Um, I moved to Australia maybe 2011, um, and I'm part of Crown Heights, the band. Um, that's who we're going into the class with, with uh, Raz Jano. Um, yeah. Yes, I am Raz Jano. Uh, Singer songwriter from the Cape Verde Islands, been in Melbourne for 15, 15 years, and uh, I'm from the Raz Jana band. So we're gonna have a jam with my brother. Yeah. Thank you for having us here. My pleasure, my pleasure, man. Yo, hey guys, um, I'm James, uh, but I go by the name DJ Impressativa. I'm a DJ and a co founder of um, Spliff Tail Entertainment and also Osvest Vibes. Yeah. Yo, so I'm I'm King Derek, and I'm co-founder of Osvies Vice, and I'm Split Entertainment as well. So um, yeah, thanks for having us, bro. Mm -hmm. Thanks to Marvin and um, yeah, well, thank Rajano you for always pulling up, man. Bless. Thanks, bro. Bless. Can you let let everyone know about Oz versus Vibe just to kick it off? Like, mm. what 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 exactly? Um, what what made you start start this event, mm. and what makes you guys you know different? and you know for, for melbourne city itself in terms of events and putting artists on mm, okay so um we've been doing events for five years i think but um was there's vibes actually started in 2019 2020 just after the lockdown and um we we got the inspiration from verses from the us from swiss beats and um timberland so they had similar thing from lockdown and then it grew up from I think from the phones and then to the stages. So similar thing we did with um as well. We started with lockdown with um artists starting on live and you know Instagram live and yeah, so after that we just had this idea of why not like because there were so many and how can we feature a lot of like a lot of them on, on the shows. So we just you know, have a meeting and then we said, okay, we can have a versus with inspiration from the actual verses from the US, have two artists or two bands, like what we're about to do now on the same stage. And then, yeah, have the songs being done one for one, you know, just to keep the vibe going, not the normal one, you know, the usual showcase, mm. have a set from another artist and they have another, but have both on the same stage, it's kind of different, you know, so yeah. Um, yeah. And so what's been, the history like? What's the you know a few of the key events that have led up to this massive to event? Massive, what have okay. what have been a few so, of the key events that you've done? Um, just for right, the city. It's yeah. just Melbourne, Melbourne, yeah, just Melbourne, Melbourne yep. for now. But we've, we have plans of you sure. know, taking it out. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, just right before this actual band, mm. um, we had Kuzai and Loki, and that was crazy as well. Some heavy hitters of the city yeah, for sure. It, it was yeah. big. Um, yeah, it was Afrobeat, and then before that we had um Nizi. And um, Melody Napoleon. Wow, yeah, and, um, mate. N yeah. Melody, he's yeah, he's man. Good, man. Yeah, that was, yeah. Shout out, Melody, that was, man. That was that was good. You know, wow. that was crazy as well. And um, they were at Ruby's Warehouse, Brunswick. Yeah. And um, yeah, since then we've been going, like yeah. you know, just to keep the vibe going. We just don't do like one type of music or one type yeah. of genre. I was about to say, so you just you know, it's very, feature, it's, it's, just, it's just featuring talented artists, talented artists and based putting locally, them on, yeah. in Australia, Melbourne, not just Melbourne. Sometimes you have artists coming from Adelaide, Sydney. This actual one has artists coming from Sydney, yeah, Jatan, and um, yeah, so yeah, we've been doing it and um, it's been good so far, and um, yeah, supporting the local music and then putting the shows. Oh, sure yeah, so. and now you've got yourself some real like major artists here mm, you know yeah, what i mean yeah, marvin man. and and russ, russ you know um 
what made you put these guys on together um, and to, to battle it out? Because, you know, I, I see them sitting on the couch together. They're chilling now, but, you know. <laughs> well, we're not going to fight. <laughs> nah, it's just friendly vibe, you yeah, know. This, yeah. is, this is not a battle, as we always say. It's just, you know, just for the vibe and, um, yeah. How, um, does it, how does it, like, um, play out on the night, do, you know? Do, so they, do they share the stage? Do they have different bands mm -hmm. or is it the same? Is it what what's happening there? Can okay, you let people so, know how it's yeah. going to go down? So it's one stage. Mm. Two bands set up at the same time. I send one band over there, the other band over there. Yeah. One song from there, one song from there, like that, with an MC, Zara Demis, in the middle. Right. So it's kind of... You know, you get one song from Crown Heights, you get one song from Razano Band, and then the vibe keeps going for the whole set. Oh, okay. And there's guest artists as well. There's Shathers, there's um, yep. Japan, Japan, there's Jungle City Collective, the dancers. Um, yeah, nice. Yeah, it's amazing you're putting the city on, man. As well, man. Yeah, yeah you'd like some down. surprise Locked cooking. <laughs> Everyone's ready to go. Yeah, yeah. How about you guys? Like, have you been performing much lately um, because of the lockdowns? Obviously, no one could perform. This is like a, a show that we're leading up to. How do you guys feel about, you know, this show? Do you, do you feel like it's going to be quite quite special? Yeah, it's going to be great, man. I'm yeah. really excited. Um, yeah, we've had a few shows since lockdown. It's been good. We've had a few shows. Obviously, it's not as great as it was before, mm. but it's been good. Even we done, um, I've done yeah. a versus with them before with uh, Slicker One. Yeah. Yo, um, how did that go? Yeah, it was great. Great no, vibe. Slicker's yeah. a beast, though. Yeah. 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 And, that's my, and that's my friend as well. So yeah. that's why I, yeah. it's the same thing with Ras as well. So yeah. for me, everyone thinks, oh, you're clashing. It's going to be like, ah, oh, anger. Yeah. It's like, no, it's love. love. It's love. Of course, of course. When he's performing, I'm supporting his song. Do you get what I mean? It's yeah. like that's that's the vibe. So it's like good energy with mm -hmm. with love. So um, that's why we're excited to do it again. Um, and obviously to do it with live bands, it's a bit different because before we was using DJs. Sure. Now it's the full band, yeah. full on sound. Like yeah, really excited. It's gonna be good. Yeah, nice, yeah. nice. How are you feeling about yeah, it? Yeah, I'm very excited because when they told me. First I tell them no, I don't want a competition, I don't compete, you know what I mean? I don't want to. Because the music you play is reggae, the main yeah, stage is love, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah. But then they explain to me it's a love vibes. There is no prize there, that's there's right. nothing. Nah. Yeah. So we're gonna go, gonna smash the night and entertain you. That's what we do, you know? I feel like it's a friendly competition. Yeah, yeah. it's a friendly Yeah, yeah. that, that yeah. brings out the best in artists. Too. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. We we, yeah. we play one by one, and then in the end we join. We play so we play shows together anyway. <laughs> yeah, we right? done, man. My band is played for Marvin. Wow. We play so many shows together. That's right. Yeah, but right. it's something interesting. Uh, the main thing is to support these guys because yeah. I've seen what they've done. It's something new. It's new. It's unique. Yeah, it's that's different. Right. Yeah, People it's unique. Really I'm curious like, yeah. myself because mm. it's unique. You know. Yeah. And it's true. Uh, it, yeah. I, yeah. I see the way they work. I love the way they work. Like you guys too, yeah? That's right, man. So you yeah. do. No, I, respect, I love to support man. people like that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. And uh, so we're looking forward to it, you know? I think definitely the energy there, you know, you can't go wrong. You know, you, you've got the energy on stage. You have the, the promoters that are doing their thing. Yeah, exactly. You, you've got a lot going on. And it, and it's a real vibe, for real, for real. We've got Ollie in the house popping in. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. Big vibes, man. Big yeah, man. entertainment here. Nice. You know what I'm saying? Wait. Yeah, yeah. Culture sound the building too, for real, for real. Yeah, yeah. It should be great. And yeah. Plus, some amazing. It's not only us on the night. So you got uh, JCI, which is a great DJ. Yeah. Yes. You got yeah. Zari Demos, yeah. which is gonna host. So uh, Shotas, Jatang, some amazing jungle cities. Mm -hmm. So and I more, I think. Like yeah. That. So <laughs> what time does it kick off? Like. So from 9 p.m.? 9. Yeah, non-stop. Non-stop. Yeah. Non -stop. No, no end. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's, there's going to be... So when you go home. <laughs> when right. you go home. So there's no yeah. license, like you can go... Oh, uh, I think we three, have, yeah. Yeah, yeah now you're going three o'clock, yeah. Three must. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, the vibe... So it's a full night. Like full for, night. for those watching, thinking of coming down, mm. you best, you know, best save your energy. You know, from mm. now until June... The Man, save the night. 17th, I was thinking, yep. June 17th. Saturday. June seventeenth, Saturday yeah. night. Okay, so you know you've got like a lot of major songs out there, you know, Marvin yourself, you know, mm -hmm. that I know of. I don't know Russ, a few of those, but you know, what kind of hit like songs are you thinking of dropping that the fans can expect to hear? Oh, I'm. Uh, I, it's a surprise. Yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. No, surprise. Like, you know, I'm gonna look you, like, look you up, you know, and they might want to hear. See. Oh yeah, obviously you can look me up on Spotify. I've got a few hits out there, as you know. Yeah, like, yeah. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I've got a few songs, but I'll. I'm gonna surprise everyone with the songs. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. The same, you know. People already know my songs in Melbourne. I've been here for a long time, so. Mm -hmm. And uh, we probably do a couple of new ones too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and okay. a few covers yeah. as well. Yep. Yeah, a couple of covers. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, 
We have so many plans. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! Yeah. Okay. We want to make sure that, you know people pay their ticket to come and enjoy them. Yes, and enjoy it like fun. always we do. You know. Yeah. yeah. So. Yeah. And uh, that's the main point: entertainment. You know, make people happy, yeah. and everybody yeah. get involved in in the, on the night. You know. Yeah, you've got dancers. Yeah, you've dancers. Got sport acts. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Everything. And then you guys are coming on later on and yeah. then doing the whole show mm -hmm. yeah yeah that's a real we don't even know how many songs we're gonna play yet so yeah maybe yeah. 10 songs each <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because really. we're gonna play this song that's how right. many people we're in the band stay. for you guys uh my i think would be seven seven piece? Yeah. Six, and, six. Six, yeah. and your band's crown heights, crown heights. Six, yeah. Yeah. and yours is yeah we sometimes eight nine but we try to make it <sighs> wow. less because the yeah. you know yeah. It's gonna be two bands on stage. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. One. Well, it should be good. Yeah. Nice, nice, nice. Well, you know, just for the channel as well. Like people will be watching. You know, what kind of projects you you know both have coming up that you're working on, mm -hmm. um, or that you've already finished up that you know people can check out. Yeah, um, I've got some projects coming out with the band and myself. I always put out solo songs. Like you can always go on the Spotify. You know, what I mean, yeah. you can always find them on Spotify. Um, yeah, but got, we've got projects, as I said, with Crown Heights and myself. Um, the next song we've got actually come out, I think it comes out for when we're doing the performance. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, that would be... Oh, it's going to drop yeah, in the same kind yeah, of time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, yeah. That's, that's a surprise. That's, 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 that's exclusive, surprise. man. You know, we're going to get that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We'll, yeah, 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 yeah. we'll be sure to drop that, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's a lot. Yeah, we got a lot of shows coming up. Uh, I've got a lot of songs to record, but I'm just waiting for the right time, you know, Yeah. to put them out, so... But uh, we we are quite busy, you know. Yeah. yeah. In the next few months, so. What 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 like, makes you like keep going, in 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 making music yourself? What's what's the mission for you, Russ? Uh, my uh, my mission is the is the main thing is the message in my music. You know what I mean? The message of peace, love, and unity, and uh, you know, talk for those who can't talk because the musician we have platform we can talk for so many people at the same time. Yeah. So. I talk for those people who can't talk, you know what I mean? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And but the main thing is the is the message in the music, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. To spread the word of love, you know? Mm -hmm. You know, equal rights and justice and all those things, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we need that in the world. Yeah, we need it in this world too. Yeah. So Yeah, man. Yeah. I do music is is for the message, you know, mainly. Who were your inspirations when you were, you know, starting out with Ah, uh, yeah. From beginning, you know, Peter Tosh, Jacob Miller, the old school. I, I'm blessed to have the opportunity when I was a kid to to listen to them, you know? Yeah. And that's what, and because of them, I really learned English properly. Yeah, when yeah, I went yeah. to high school, I already knew the English, yeah. so the teacher was not happy because <laughs> these guys, <laughs> you know what I mean? So, <laughs> so, yeah, I was blessed to have a chance to... You have the cassette, you know, the tape, video yeah, tapes. man, yeah, yeah, and uh, vinyl. So when I was a kid, so they they one of the big inspirations. Yeah. There's some African artists as well, like Fela, Femi Kuti, Femi Kuti, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Fela, you know what I mean. Yeah. So Yusundu, yeah, so many, yeah, Cesare Evra for my country, yeah, for sure. Yourself, my other man, like um, any inspirations, you know, for for your musical style or you know just getting into music oh, in general. Yeah, um, well, I'm from a musical background. My yeah. dad is uh, Maxi Priest, who's a, yeah, a reggae legend. Your dad is my inspiration too. No, that's for the competition. Yeah. <laughs> you know, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> You know what I mean? So that's I've right. been lucky enough to like grow up in it. So that's how it started for me. Like yeah. even um, but even what why I continue to do music now is just for the love. I don't know anything different. Like do you get what I mean? That's that's all I really know. Whether whether it does great or does bad, I'm always gonna do music yeah. till I finish. Do you get what I mean? I feel you, man. Yeah, and that's just that that's it's just in me. Um, and as I said, I've grew up in it. Um, I've toured and. I've uh, done pretty much everything that you can do in music, even for myself as a solo artist. I've like sold platinum records, I've sold yeah, gold, wow. I've uh, songwriting. What did it feel awards. like when, when you when you you know you got to those levels? What was the um, what happened in your life at that time? Well, it, 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 it's 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 weird because you set out goals when you start out, innit? Yeah. Like, and you set you're like, oh, I want an award, I want to win an award, I want to. Mm. I want a plaque. Yeah. I want. I want a platinum plaque. I want a gold plaque. Like, do you get what I mean? These yeah. things that you, you, yeah. you that you want. So it's like, um, and then when you get them, obviously you're really happy. But then you just, it's like, then you're now. What's the next goal then? And then it's like, so for me, it's like, 
I, as I said, I, I just continue to make music. So whether they make awards or they don't, it doesn't really bother me. It's like, obviously you want to achieve greatness yeah. all the time. But if it doesn't, it's like, next song, great. Next yeah. song, go with the next. And I've just continued to live like that. Um, and then obviously I get to express a lot with my band, with Crown Heights, because that's now taking it from when, you know, I come from digital era where we had a lot of digital producers. Yep. Now we're just all live. Do you get what I mean? Wow, so it's yeah. like, that's even a different experience again and creates even a, another different sound. So I'm, I'm, I'm always going to enjoy it. I think I just, I'm like super impressed with like, you know, having your, your dad like be this mega super mm. artist, mm -hmm. but then you also achieved success in yes, music yes it's very rare that happens you know what i mean yeah, like that's rare. for me i go wow that's that's right. very rare yeah. and special mm. you know so you know and and you're obviously blessed with seeing that yeah sure the, the awards are one thing mm. however the vibe and the energy is is where you're at you know yes. and, and you're performing we're blessed to have you perform you know at still a, going, at a, at still going to local music. yeah local mm. events mm -hmm. but obviously it's more than just the accolades and the numbers, it's like just the vibe well, and the energy. Also, sorry to cut you, in, in yeah. saying that I'm also like, cause my love is reggae. I love reggae. Love it, so, yeah. and it, in, um, it might not like chart as like pop songs do. So yeah. mm -hmm. in that regards, you, for me you, in, when you're doing like reggae and unique types of music, you have to be at events like this. Yeah, because of course, you have, yeah. It's, yeah. Because especially like in Australia and Melbourne and yeah. areas like that, it's literally like at the ground. Mm -hmm. Like we're trying to get it up Absolutely. to where it's national on the radio, like uh, sure. you know, on yeah. the Novas and whatever, FMs yeah. or whatever. So it's like, so you have to build it from somewhere. So mm. when you can get like all people together, like Ras Jano and all of the other yeah. acts that are doing and on the same kind of mission to yeah. get to this point, it's like, how can I not be a part of it? I'll be yeah. silly to not do yeah, it. Yeah, like, yeah. You know I mean? no, it. It's in your like, yeah. heart and soul, just like a calling, you know? It, and yeah, then we've got 100%. people like yourselves to, yeah. to allow to that to happen. Yeah. 100%. And it's, that's, I think fun. that's what Melbourne is very special for. 100%. There's this kind of just like relaxed feeling that we yeah. can all just, you know, get together yeah, and make it happen. The, I yeah. was gonna say the gelling. Yeah, yeah, yeah the gelling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. man, that's, that's, that's awesome, man. With, with reggae, y'all can answer is like, I love I love reggae, you know, come growing up too and everything. But obviously, yeah, you move to things like Afrobeats, R and B, mm -hmm. you know, rap music. Mm -hmm. It's all kind of like a similar thing in the same mm -hmm. sense. Mm -hmm. But do you feel like you would, you know, you you it's reggae and it's reggae only, or do you think you'd be open to collaborations with other artists from different genres? Is that oh. something you would do, or is it just like no, hundred percent. I'm always into I like if you um. Even songs that, like, I work with all different artists. So I'm right. always making music mm -hmm. with artists from all different places all over the world. I have no particular genre. Yeah. It's just that, um, uh, but where I'm at in this present moment right now, yeah. that's where I'm at. And I, and that, that's where I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling the, the band, where the band is grooving. But even, I, I, I use the, say, all right, reggae, but it's not necessarily reggae because it's a mixture of mm -hmm. my influences from R&B, yeah. my influences yeah. from pop, pop. Yeah. my influences yeah. from this. So I might, it might be genre as reggae, but when you actually listen to the music, it doesn't, it, it's, it might not be a classified as full reggae. Yeah, you get yeah, what I mean? yeah, it's, yeah. It's, um, so yeah, I mean, you know, people have remixed Bob Marley tunes. Yeah, 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 exactly. yeah, yeah, yeah. They made yeah. the house remixes, of course, of you know, course. and those are like, beautiful and positive they've kept yeah. that essence to it well that, that's the you most know? important thing yeah. it's just so long yeah. as i can i'm staying real to myself mm. that because that's the most important thing for me at this time because as i mentioned i've been like signed to labels and mm. like you know and sometimes you don't get to be the person that you actually want to be whether that's reggae yeah. whether it's r&b whether it's whatever because mm. someone else wants you to have something so that they can sell it other yeah. than you wanting to be something yeah, to, for it. To, you are not yourself. You get what I mean? Yeah, <laughs> that's like, man. So that's important. So that's, yeah. that's, and so we're in an independent setting now. We have all yeah, those independent vibes. Right. Yeah, man. And there's like, it's the independent battle of the bands. Yeah. Exactly. You know what I mean? And it's freedom. It's freedom. Yeah. Right. yeah. Freedom. And yeah. you can do anything you want. There's no restrictions <laughs> on, on, the, on what you want to do with sound, especially like with the internet and sure. everything. Like you can just create what you want. Yeah. And just go. Yeah. Exactly. yeah. Let's put it out. Let's see there. what the world see. see yeah, I was world, yeah, talking to some art, uh, an artist like, no. you go season today or uh, from Lagos, Nigeria, and he was saying, you know, TikTok and those kind of platforms. I know it's just like it's a lot, but it basically said you just put a snippet out, see if the world likes it, yeah. and then go yeah, from there. That's where it's at now. Yeah. Are you guys, how do you manage, you know, the new social media, AI, all the 
tech note stuff that I know reggae bands would just say, nah. I can't be bothered <laughs> dealing with it, you know. Russ, how do you how, how yeah. do you feel about it and how do you manage that side I'm not, of music? I'm not fantastic in social media and good, but it's been benefit for me. I've got international gigs because of social right. media. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And uh well it's got is good and bad. Mm. Yeah. But we just have to keep going with it. We have to be on it because it's the new generation. I think it's important to be on it. Is yeah. an artist can be his own manager these days, can be his own create his own world. Yeah. yeah. Because now actually the fans, they want to you to be direct with them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know what I mean? So yeah. yeah, we just go with change, you know what I mean? So Yeah, and I think now yeah. now it's it's it's, it's good. Um, I, I'm I'm with it, yeah. so I just need to be better, like on it. Yeah. <laughs> no, I can I can feel it, man, because yeah. it's like you shouldn't have to w- yeah. worry about it as yeah. as such a soul. I don't worry. Artist. I just I don't worry. Because, but but I feel there's yeah, a responsibility yeah, to the kids is. now because yeah, there's so exactly. much other crap out there yes. that's really negative. Yes. Yes. And right. with with the stuff that we're all going to make yeah. on that night on the yeah. 17th of June, yeah. Oz versus Vibes, get yeah. your tickets. Yeah. Um, we'll tickets. definitely be you know uh, producing content out there for yeah, the younger realize. generation that will pop up in their feed and maybe brighten up their day. Yeah. Mm-hmm. To see the positivity, you know what I mean? Yeah. I agree. Um, positivity. It's right, media, man. Yeah. It's very it's important. Fair. The internet is very important. Um, again, if you want to continue to reach out to people, you need to use it. You Otherwise, need to use it. You're mm-hmm. going to miss out. Like, yeah. I'm trying to get as good as yeah. I can. I've got the <laughs> band, actually. Because yeah, exactly. there's six members. I'm like, look. Yeah. One, everybody. Get, everybody get on it. Yeah, yeah, so yeah you've got something, yeah, you post yeah, something, yeah. you got yeah. something, you post, yeah. just, just everyone get on it. These guys, yeah, they're, yeah, they're great. They're, they're great. great. Yeah. Versus, man. Yeah, right. yeah. The yeah. Promo there. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, 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 man. It's a good look, yeah. Yeah. We've... How do you guys, you know, how did you evolve, you know, obviously with, with social media and promotions? How did mm. you, you know, what's been the journey with promotions in terms of promoting events? Because it's not easy. Promoting music can kind of be easy if the song's yeah. good. That's yeah. right. But, you know, promoting a night, you know. It's hard. Have you got any advice? You know? Yeah, so um, with promo, it's, it's one of the hardest things when mm-hmm. it comes, especially in Melbourne, mm-hmm. because there's so many alternatives of events. Mm-hmm. There's, you know, there's so much yeah. of similar music out there. So you have to try to keep whatever you're doing as mm-hmm. unique as you can mm-hmm. so that people can actually relate to what you're doing because there's so many people doing whatever you think you're doing. Sure. Yeah. But how unique is yours? How genuine? Or how mm-hmm. like people can actually know? Oh, this is from these guys. You know, like something that will help with the promo and actually reaching out to people to help out. Like you know, reaching out to team from Oli. You know, build the connections like that. You know, so we you know people from the radio. We need you know, the, you know stuff like that. But it's all. Like with the events we do, people reach out as well. You know, I've seen you doing some good stuff. I want to support. What can I do? Oh, maybe, you know, try organize something, help. So it's like that. But just try to be unique as you can. I think that's the... Key. That's something that's one of the keys. Yeah, okay. I definitely think this year and, and hopefully towards the next year is the spiritual awakening happening. The ego mm. is being lost mm. through social media, yeah. uh, through the connectivity of things because... Nothing will happen without reaching out and yeah. and talking and just connecting. Yeah, you know, the and I see it. And I see it with that. what you're doing. Yeah. Yeah. Like it's it's big time things, you know. Yeah. So yeah. we're onto something here mm. for sure, for yeah. sure. And this is the diff- this is the biggest I, I think I'll say. Yeah. With venue wise, with um, Cox and Band Room. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. It's a great, great venue. venue. So whoa, great venue. it's gonna be it's Bang. gonna be massive, you know. And um, we can't wait. We've not even seen it happen ever. Yeah. Having two bands on the stage. We've never, so we like I never, excited I never to see it how the night we even go. I never seen it before. So, nah. So we got so, a, it's an excitement for everybody, for us. Everybody's yeah. excited. For everyone who's coming. For everyone we reach out media. to. Really? Yeah. I'm really. It's going to be crazy. I don't want to yeah. really No, because I can tell, how. I can see the momentum, man. Mm, I'm like, yes. yo, mm. it's, it's, bo- it's boiling up. Yeah. 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 yeah, especially yeah. in the middle of winter, exactly. too. Yeah, yeah. man. It's <laughs> winter, too. Exactly. Like, you, you don't need a jacket yeah. there, man. That, nah. Man. <laughs> it's going to be fire. Just, don't, yeah. bring don't bring your jacket. Don't bring your jacket. Yeah, yeah. Bring your dancing <laughs> shoes. That's it. Don't dance your shoes. Man. Yeah, man. Is, yeah, there's some good DJs on there. Yeah, amazing. Jesse I, you know. What kind of music are the DJs playing? Is it like a bit of a mix or is it like. So, a bit of a mix. Afrobeat, dancehall, reggae, hip hop, we playing everything. Yeah. Just the Afrobeat. 
Yo, so then you yeah. can kind of like, you can vibe yeah, and exactly. you can kind of listen to the band and Everything. Like experience yeah. music. That's and right. even the bands are not just going to be playing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, I get you. It's going to be nice. Nice, nice. good work. Yeah. 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 It's a good vibe. I'm excited, excited. about these nights. Yeah. So. yeah, yeah. So nah, looking good forward good. to it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Appreciate it. Appreciate your time coming down here. Nah, thanks Thank for you for having us. Having us, bro. Yeah. It's got to come back, you know what I'm saying? Talk about some deeper, you know, deeper work. Yeah. topics and yes, whatnot. Bro. Yeah. Yeah. Thank Bring you for me. having us. Yes, you guys bro. do an amazing work. Keep it up. Yeah. And people, subscribe to TMC channel That's because the they're doing amazing work. They're supporting us, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, musicians. So we need, it, the bigger they get, yeah. better yeah. for us. <laughs> and um, <laughs> They're doing amazing work. Tickets are running out fast for the show. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Get your tickets. Better, you know, you get it right now. Don't yes. pay more at the door or just even second release. So it's better to get it now at um, austin.com.au. Yeah. Just yeah. search... You know, Crown Highs versus Razzano Band or Oz Guys. They're going to find it. If they want to come, they're going to find it. Yeah, it's online everywhere. Yeah, yeah. So just, yeah they you can even hop on to TMC Media. It's there yeah. as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We'll make the link for sure. <laughs> yeah. For sure, let's get so, it. Yeah, yeah let's get it. Now, support, support, it, support local, man. For real, for real. Support yeah, man. Local. Yeah, you know. Um, More than that, just, yeah, be free. Let we always support people as well, so. Yeah. We got, we got. Well, um, yeah, no, much, much, love, much love for you guys coming through one time. Yeah, respect. It's, having it's been a little quick, you know, one for the road. You yeah. feel me? Mm -hmm. We'll stay tuned. We'll kick back next time. But um, yeah, one love and uh, buy yes, your tickets. Sir. Yes, sir. Bless up.